What happened was, a few years ago, the world's largest pharmaceutical company put out a scientific paper that said that all of this science was wrong, dead wrong. That resveratrol did not work on these proteins. In fact, another group said that sirtuins have nothing to do with aging. It was a really depressing time of my life. I had emails from top scientists sending me condolences. The clinical trials were put on hold. I thought I'd let my lab down. I thought I'd let Australia down. I thought I'd let the whole world down. And there were days where I really just wanted to quit being a scientist. But the good news was, the silver lining was that it forced us in the lab to go back and really understand how did resveratrol and these other synthetic drugs actually work. So I pulled together a group of scientists, there were about 30 of us, and we set to work to understand what was true. And what we've discovered is that resveratrol really does bind to that Pac-Man and sticks on the back of it and makes it jump fast, faster. And that is how they all work. We were surprised. We didn't realize that resveratrol and these drugs would all work the same way, but they do. 